Hi, I'm James, and in this video I am taking a look at the performance difference between Intel's 14 nanometer uh, sort of lake cores and their new 10th generation Ice Lake 10 nanometer core. Um, so for our point of comparison, we are using a KB Lake U uh, i5 7300U. Uh, this wouldn't be my perfect choice. Uh, ideally, we would use a Core i3-8130U, uh, which is a Coffee Lake chip. Unfortunately, I no longer have one of these, so I've chosen the KB Lake U, which has a 3.5 GHz turbo speed, but a slightly smaller um, 3 MB L3 cache, as opposed to the 3.4 GHz turbo speed of the Ice Lake U, which has a 4 MB L3 cache. So not identical sort of specifications of these chips, but something that is broadly comparable. Um, I have tested i3-8130U, and there isn't a big difference between that and the 7300U uh, anyway. And what we can see in this test is both in the single and multi-threaded components, uh, the Ice Lake chip is around 11% faster. Um, given that there is the slight clock speed advantage for the KB Lake and both maintain their peak top uh, peak turbo speed pretty much consistently through this test, that suggests we are seeing some reasonable um, IPC or um, instruction per clock gains with these Ice Lake U chips. Of course, the Ice Lake does also have the advantage of faster memory speed, and in this case, my KB Lake is a Surface. Pro 2017 tablet, whereas the Dell Inspiron 153593 uh, laptop does obviously have a bit more cooling, but the fact that both were maintaining top turbo speeds throughout suggests that the cooling shouldn't be a massive in issue in this test. So as we can see then with these new 10 nanometer cores, we should be seeing a reasonable boost in performance when running at similar clock speeds and um, potentially even where you have a bit of a deficit in the clock speeds should be equal or better than the performance of their 14 nanometer predecessors. I hope you found this video interesting and um, do hit like if you have. Let us know in the comments what you would like to see us testing on these chips in the future and hit subscribe if you'd like to see more videos as we post them. Thanks for watching.